What's up guys, it's Neil Smith here, and today we are we are doing a Martin Luther project. What's happened Martin Luther Project? No, it's not Martin Luther King Jr. It's Martin Luther of the of the Protestant Reformation during the medieval ages. So where are we now? We are in Luther's childhood and his father's copper mine. His father was a copper was a copper miner. And and next in mine, he was a ore smelter too. He smelted the ores, and he sold them and made profit on those. And so this is what mine looked like: copper, copper one, copper two, copper three, copper everywhere. Kind of makes sense, doesn't it? Because it's a copper mine. And so then, and so then, and then so then his dad, and so his. Then Luther's dad said, nah, this is not, this is not that good of a job. I kind of want you to get a better job. And and, in, and instead of being a copper, might get a good job like um, a lawyer. He really wanted him to, he, he, he really, really begged for him to become a lawyer. So with, with being a lawyer, he went to Rome study and, and did like, did like, did like nowadays study stuff. How method of study now go to universities and stuff. So in Rome, he saw many bad things going on. Not like torturing execution stuff. He saw like indulgences. Indulgences were 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 sell were money were people people selling money to get to get to get to get many to to get forgiveness from God and Martin Luther said no that's not that's not right God is the one and so he opposed the indulgences and and then him and, then, and then many other things went wrong with the church so he said you know what? so he went up and he bam the 95 theses and with the 95 theses he 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 pointed out that, and so And so then he was brought to the Edict of Worms, or Diet of Worms. And so in the Diet of Worms, he was brought before the Holy Roman Emperor, the Holy Roman Empire. No, not the whole, not the Roman Empire, but the Holy Roman Empire. So you got your cardinals and you got bishops, and and guards and and clergy, powerful people, and very very wealthy, profitable people. And so he, and so at first, the pe the the authority said, ah, think think of it as a good thing that what we're doing. Think of it as that. They try to convince him, but the rock wouldn't move. So they said, Martin Luther, we didn't want to do this, but we're excommunicated from the church. Boom. And so, and so, when so when he was excommunicated, they, a uh, divine prince came in and said. Come to my castle. I'm gonna. I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you live here until the whole stink about the church and that stuff is gone, and then you, then you can go. Out. And then within the within the time that he was in the castle, le and then and then he translated the Bible from Latin into other languages, like German, France, and England, English, French, and English, and so later. Once the whole thing died down, he he married he married Luth Catherine von Bora, and with Catherine von Bora, he left priest priesthood and that stuff, the clergyhood, and so he, he married her, and so he was he she died, my Vor, Bora died, Mrs. Madame Bora died, and so he was a widow, and so once everything died down. Was wife and that stuff. He died, and then to heaven, and so in heaven, he was, and so in heaven, I don't know what he did, but he's gone. Let's just say, and so, and so yeah, that was my video. I hope you like, share, subscribe, 
leave a comment leave a comment about my bills and so as you if if you see here this is not the church that's a facade that i made and so that was the house and peace out everyone